Last time on Great Southern Travellers. Ice cream. Ice cream. Good day, and welcome to Great Southern Travellers. I'm Emma. And I'm Joe. We've recently given up our jobs and started on our lap of Australia. Dive in and join us every Thursday for the adventure. Leaving Portland, we made a last minute call to turn north and head for the famous Grampian Mountains before crossing the border into South Australia. Just driven the one hour drive from Sun and Dunkel through the Grampians and now we're at Falls Gap. So gonna take a little look around, go to the information center, see what's to see around here, but we think we're gonna go to Mackenzie Falls at some point and the balcony. Um, balcony with the, with the heads of lookout. So it should be a pretty nice day. There is a massive ice cream shop. It's a bit of a shame it's not too warm today, but it is like the full length of a whole block. So we're just at the start. We're at Wonderland Car Park and uh, it's a uh, 4.5k return to the Pinnacle Lookout. Uh, we're going to do the Grand Canyon as well, but that's closed. Um, so we're just going see what we have to see, really. But uh, nice to get the legs moving again. Oh, we nice to get the legs. Opening up some views for us. I think they're the chimney stacks. Is that a thing to see, is it? Yeah, I think it's a thing to see. There you go. Chimney stacks. Bag on the back didn't help. So I hope you guys enjoyed the view. I look forward to watching it back on camera as well. Uh, unfortunately, I couldn't make it to the end because bits of me that shouldn't be pulsating were pulsating. Um, but what I was going to say is this. This is probably our fourth decent sized walk, um, including one that, that happened on the second day. And on that walk on the second day, we thought, okay, before we do this again, we've got to buy a two litre water bladder to put in the backpack, which we've done. Uh, we've got to remember the speaker in case we want some music uh, when things get a bit of a drag towards the end. And we must bring those Roundtree's fruit pastels that you bought back from the UK, Joe, with us. Fourth walk, 
fourth time we've forgotten them. And all I want in the world right now is to have a little lolly in my mouth and suck on it as I amble down the hill. I'm not sure what the lesson here is, but you know, I'm feeling it. Well, we made it back to the car. Um, so it was, a, it was about a 4.2 kilometer return. It took about an hour 15, which is better than what the sign says. It says two to two and a half. Um, having a little Pepsi Max back at the car after we cooled down. And then we're going up to Mackenzie Falls now. Um, we'll, I'm sure we'll show you a little bit of that, but cheers. We're at uh, Mackenzie Falls. It's just Ooh, on, up the glorious. road um, from where we just went, um, the walk to the, uh, the Pinnacle. Um, so we're going to apparently park from some steep stairs. We're going to walk down the stairs. Yeah, it's 625 meters. Should we go and have a look at this lookout first? Yeah. Um, 625 meters each way, um, but very steep. But first, we've, that's not my face, but first we've come to a lookout. <laughs> Ooh, watch out, watch out. Step, step. You can see how that would be tempting to swim. Well, I think that's the top of the falls. <laughs> yeah, it's the top of the falls. Look out for the day. So we're continuing our ice cream tour of Australia. This seems to have become the go-to somehow, doesn't it? Yeah. Find somewhere nice, got a local creamery. Happy days. At home of the uh, waffle cone, handmade waffle cone. So. Or at least that's what they're waffling on about. <laughs> Classic. So this evening we're doing a little bit of a mix. I'm going to make a peri peri of a peri peri mayonnaise peri peri chicken burrito bowl kind of a couple of things we've got we've got some chicken rice um some frozen be uh, fr frozen veggies um black beans i've got a little bit of a pre-made um tomato and onion mix that i already made so that will go in really nicely and of course got some rice and, and a top with some cheese now people i've watched before do this while camping normally drink wine while they're doing it i'm going to drink solo so if you see me drinking out of my cat mug it'll be solo cheers one cut up the chicken step two add chicken to the pan step three season four add spice mix. step five add your veggies to boiling water step six add pre-prepared tomato and onion from a previous dinner to the mix Step seven, um, add your black beans. Step eight, add your cooked veggies. Step nine, chop up your avocado for a little bit of garnish. Step 10, add your rice. Step 11, serve. 
peri peri mayo, a little bit of cheese. Step 12. Enjoy! Unlucky step 13, make somebody else do the washing up. Uh, alongside tonight's chef extraordinaire, this is tonight's campground. It's called... Plantation. Plantation, named after the fact it's a plantation. It's about nine kilometers out of Hall's Gap. Uh, we're still in the Grampians, or just technically outside the National Park. It's a free camp, it's got um, drop toilets, it's got a load of non-potable water, and treat of treats, what do we have tonight, Dal? We had a bush shower. Yeah, so they've got a, a bucket you can fill with the non-potable water. It's got a little um, shower head on it. So we got to have a wash. So we are clean after our day's hikes and um, smelling pretty good for it. Next time on Great Southern Travel. <laughs>